European Union MEPS agree on making USB Type-C the standard charging connector. This past week, the EU's Internal Market and Consumer Protection Committee agreed on adopting USB Type-C as the Union's standard charging connector, with 43 votes in favor and two against. It's part of the Radio Equipment Directive and it means that USB-C is now very close to becoming the de facto connector for charging a wide range of consumer electronics. The charging standard will apply to what the committee calls small and medium-sized electronic gadgets and include mobile phones, tablets, digital cameras, headphones and headsets, handheld video game consoles and portable speakers. Exemptions will apply for devices that are too small to incorporate a USB-C port, such as smartwatches, health trackers and some sports equipment. The directive still has to be approved by the EU Parliament, which is expected to happen in May during the plenary session. There will be an initial transition period and the new requirements aren't expected to start to apply until early 2024. In addition to the new directive, the MEPS also want to see clear labeling on devices in terms of how much power they can deliver, since this can sometimes be hard to figure out as a consumer. They also want to see clear labeling on product packaging if a charger is supplied or not. Furthermore, the MEPS want the European Commission to present a strategy with regards to wireless chargers by the end of 2026, to make sure there's some kind of minimal interoperability between the various wireless charging standards. This is said to be to try and avoid market fragmentation, as well as to reduce e-waste and to try and prevent consumer lock-in to proprietary charging standards. The EU is said to end up with 11 to 13,000 tons of e-waste from chargers alone on a yearly basis, so it's not hard to see why the union wants to see a unified charging standard for most electronics.